guys you are welcome back to my channel thank you very much for always stopping by i really do appreciate if you are here for the first time kindly subscribe click on the notification button for more updates and don't forget to give us a thumbs up thank you very much once again i really do appreciate god bless you all reviewed how bandit brought back traditional ruler to his house after kidnapping him in niger state it was gathered that the district head was transported back on three motorcycles, each conveying two persons, including the victim yesterday at 8.30 p.m. It has been reported that the released dodo of Wawa community in Baragu Kingdom, Baragu local government area of Niger State, Dr. Hamed Ali was reportedly returned to his palace by those that adopted him last saturday daily trust also reports that his kidnap was due to a strong opposition against criminal activities perpetrated by the bandits in his area it was also gathered that the district head was transported back on three motorcycles each conveying two persons including the victim yesterday at about 8 30 pm it was learned that the gunman brought him unnoticed during power out age and dropped him close to the palace and zoomed off from the area it would be recorded that dr aleu was kidnapped by bandits last saturday night at 10 pm a traditional title holder the walin wawo halibala Gala was contacted, said he was in his residence at about 8.30 p.m. yesterday night when he heard sound of jubilations from the people close to the palace and rushed outside. He explained that when he got outside, he saw the royal father among the people dancing and singing. According to him, after Isahe prayer, I went straight home and at exactly at 8 30 pm i heard noise or rushing out i saw the dodo in the midst of people dancing and singing close to his palace they were all happy on his release on how he was released the gala stated the dodo said they brought him on three bike bikes carrying a passengers each and because they were aware that there was no light in the community as at that time they rode close to the palace and dropped him and immediately zoomed off the warning wawo also explained that the traditional ruler told the subject that he was not tortured by the adopters but was accorded reasonable treatment however efforts to get the reaction of the dodo failed as calls put to his phone, we are not connecting. Hmm. So what is the need of adopting him? What do they discuss? Hey, <laughs> all these Fulanese are supporting those evil people. And they are only found among the devils from Fata, Jalon, and their Islamic collaborators. As your head, not correct. So these are Nigerians reacting. Hmm. What cannot happen does not exist in Nigeria. More to happen. They know themselves. They also have respect for themselves. Let's end this evil country now. Hmm. These are Nigerians reacting, as you can see. Some of them, can I say, most Nigerians are of the doubt that. How can they just adopt you? Nothing. They did not ask for any ransom. No ransom was collected. And you were not tortured. You did not even. You have not still said why they adopted you. Anyway, make we not talk go far because the man just they come back. Maybe when he don't settle down, he go really talk what to happen for inside the bush when they carry and go. But as you can see, Nigerians are saying that the bandit, the banditry business in the northern part of this country can only end when the northern elites tell themselves the truth that they enough of this business then it will actually end but if they continue to pretend it's not gonna end though it's not going to end 
But the question is, for how long are we going to go like this? For how long? For how long? Because this is just drawing us back. For how long? People are being killed by bandits every day. People are being kidnapped by bandits every day. And some persons are still there supporting them. The question Nigerians have been asking is that, why is it that up to now, Gumi, Shai Gumi, has not been arrested, or at least call him and investigate him because of the kind word when they talk. How can you say bandits can never end in Nigeria? Why? We are praying for it to end. You are saying you are protecting people. But your body language and your actions is, is, is the other way around. You get it? It's the other way around. Let's support, let's support the leaders, support the, 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 the Nigerian operatives. These people, they have suffered so much. We can't even count how many, how many soldiers that have been killed because of, you know, we know how they happen. They go, go and push them. But the question is, who they give them those intelligence reports? You get. This have to end. All right, someone said, yeah, the, ne the only thing that can end this problem is let everybody go on their own. The Northerners be on your own and answer Nigeria. We are no longer interested. Is it by force? If you marry a person, he say, I not marry again. Now, first, you leave them alone. That is what we are saying here. All right, someone just dropped that. Someone said, yeah, <laughs> Nigeria is a fraud. And anybody that continue to, you know, support this person, you will end up in a doom because nothing is going to change. Not even the next president can change anything. Do you know why? President Mamadou Buhari has already turned Nigeria upside down, he said. Wow. So, guys, I'm dropping it here. Kindly hit the comment section. Thank you very much for stopping by. I really do appreciate. Bye for now.